Hi everybody, Mike the PT here. Uh, we're talking the advanced weight bearing protocol that Dr. D does uh, after you've lengthened 80 millimeters, right? So I have a patient that just underwent that procedure and we're gonna go over the protocol for physical therapy, right? So they have, uh, they're able to weight bear full, fully, and uh, no assisted devices, no canes, no crutches, no walkers, things of that nature. So uh, they have that sway in their walk and I'm gonna demonstrate that to you. And I'm gonna show you the exercises that we're doing to target the hips and the areas that uh, help to reduce the sway while you're walking, okay? And so this will help everybody coming out of uh, limb lengthening, coming out of consolidation, and trying to get back to normal walking. So here's the exercises that you need to do. Here is an example of rehabilitation post-consolidation or after the advanced weight bearing protocol procedure has been finished. Um, we're just doing some retro walking or backwards walking using handheld assists, but the cues are to try to prevent swaying left and right and really try to engage those muscles. And the same thing with walking forward, uh, they're using my hands to help unweight just a little bit so that they can uh, fully weight bear and engage those muscles. Uh, lastly, in this uh, situation, lateral stepping uh, to work on those lateral hip muscles. All right, next is a marching exercise. And here I'm having them lean against the wall and they're stepping away from the wall two or three steps. Uh, and they're going to start focusing on shifting weight. That's the important part here. Uh, it's difficult to lift, but more importantly, we're working on shifting weight and lifting the knee up. All right, in this exercise, we are doing alternating, stepping up and stepping down. So up with left, down with right, and then switching up with right and then down with left. And you can do this on a step or stair at home if you'd like. The next exercise is lateral stepping, but this time you can use a band around the knees, ankles, or toes to increase the difficulty of the exercise. And the best exercise you can do to reduce the sway is to do backwards walking on a treadmill.